Here's an early 1940s Sears Silvertone AM tube radio in a, in a bacon light cabinet. This particular radio is actually a battery operated model that was originally designed to run on a battery pack that provided one and a half volts for the tube filaments and 90 volts for the B plus voltage. Have a look here at the sides and in the back. In a previous video you may recall me showing you this battery eliminator that was designed to run one of these old battery radios on a on standard 120 volt household current. These battery eliminators were very popular in the 40s and 50s for those customers who wish to continue to use their battery battery radio on alternating current. This is just a four tube radio, nothing special, but it, it performs pretty good. I'll turn it on here and show it to you. Okay. It's attractive than it is right now because there's an 18 playoff at the end of the road. Yeah. See, I don't think it changes, you know, football the way it's played, you know. Oh, yeah. Uh, First of all, I want, I want to congratulate the Southeast Tigers uh, for what. somewhere. They came in after midnight. Reading some spiritual journal. They'd ask God men. I don't get on to the NASCAR because I know you I heard you had your NASCAR expert in boot tonight. I'm gonna see what you're saying about the race this weekend. Tell us something, Kelly. <laughs> well uh, I'm the wrong one to ask. <laughs> I would No, Daniel Okay, enough chitter chatter. Okay, there you go. The early 40s silver tone battery operated tube radio being powered by an electro brand, as in electro brand, not the cheap electro brand name that was around in the 70s and 80s, but powered by an electro battery eliminator. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.